have you ever wanted to become a published author and you weren't sure where to start? If the answer is yes, well, today I'm with an incredible author. Her name is Maria Matias. And she's a diamond feng shui consultant, and she can help you harmonize your environment so you can attract more abundance, success, better business relationships, and a lot more. And I'm interviewing her today about her experience being part of the Global Conscious Entrepreneurs book program that enabled her to become an Amazon bestselling author, speak at an amazing conference with the celebrity Marie Diamond that impacted 700 million people worldwide and uh, so much more. So Maria, if you can tell us, please, um, some of the highlights of the uh, Global Conscious Entrepreneurs book program. What was it that you liked the best? Oh my gosh, I can go on and talk about this amazing book that um, got published with Marie Diamond and your publishing. So this is just, it was such an incredible, amazing experience where we connected all over the world, met so many like-minded people and the trainings that we got through were amazing. Not only do we just apply them with our best-selling um, book, but just in, in general in our business, how we grow our business with this amazing book. Um, like for me personally, I connected um, with, I have a contract right now who I will be doing feng shui for an amazing mansion. And that opportunity only came because I was part of this amazing book. So all the, the, the training that um, your team did, Marie, the meditations, the connections that we did has just been so amazing. So that was one of them. And the other one is that I got contacted by a um, magazine publisher who wanted to publish my story in their magazine. So I got to be part of that amazing magazine for women. I was like, wow, this is so cool. So it was such an amazing experience to meet all of our like-minded community people that we connected with and so supportive. And the team, everybody jumped in. If you needed something, let me help you. Or you personally like sending us um, uh, personal WhatsApp information just in case we missed out because there was just so much going on. So I felt like it was really personalized and really helped us grow um, personally. So I'm just so grateful for this amazing opportunity that I got to be part of. Perfect. And what uh, was the highlight in terms of like um, personal development or did you get like any like healing experience from writing or did you feel like uh, boosting confidence at all? Or um, like, did you did you find a transformation in yourself from doing the process? Oh, absolutely. I was never really this confident on, on camera per se, but all the training that you you all did with the team, it's like, oh, I can do this. And the meditations that we did to up level our, um, to empower us to be able to come across media because it's not something that just comes to you, right? You It takes some um, presentation and training to do it. And personally, that's, another level that I got out of um, the training that we did with you. Beautiful. You find, thank you so much. And did you find, for example, like the marketing templates that we provided, was that useful at all in terms of like um, adding a bit of attention to the book or to yourself or to your business? Was that helpful? The marketing templates that you um, that were done for, for you? Oh, absolutely. That's how I got contacted because of my banners that I changed on my social media. So, wow, like you, I want to interview you. <laughs> like and it was because of what I posted on my social media. Absolutely. Amazing. Okay. And what about like the um, very, you know, uh, the introduction to like speaker, um, speaker training that we did uh, to prepare you for the conference? Was that useful at all? Did you find that um, useful or interesting? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Because. To be honest with you, when we, we were practicing prior to the training, I was nervous. Not only was I nervous, but my topic, I was kind of all over the place. 
but how um, you and your team, Marie, brought us together, how to speak, how to get across what we want to say was empowering as well. Because when I did my interview then um, with Marie, I was very confident. It, it was, it was, it came across powerful for me because it was, I, I wasn't there before, before the training. So I'm very grateful for that. Yeah. And you know what I found when you were speaking at the conference that you really looked so confident, so beautiful, like your, you know, your background looked really awesome. You were, you know, well presented. You, you looked awesome. You, you, um, you can say you looked awesome from all perspectives and you sounded awesome and you were like looking at the camera and you were so confident and I'm thinking, like, have you spoken uh, before, like before this conference? Are, are, are you quite an experienced speaker? I was an inexperienced speaker. That's why when I did the training, I was so grateful because, my gosh, I'm going to be in front of a celebrity and I'm being trained how to do this. So it was very, very powerful. No, I was never that confident on on camera and speaking. Was it definitely was confident. Was this your first time speaking at a conference or have you spoken at multiple conferences before? I've spoken at some conferences, but nothing like what we did. <laughs> Let's put it yeah. that way. And I think that adds a lot of pressure as well to be to know that that interview was going to be used for a podcast and that interview was going to be used for multiple TV channels and, you know, to be on Amazon Fire TV. I think that adds a lot of pressure. Did you feel that pressure of having to perform? Oh, yeah, for sure. And then that's why then you put the effort in like really being present for these trainings so you can get your message out there so you can look confident on, on camera, be confident, not just look confident, but bring the um, confidence out. And what sure. would you say for people that maybe don't know how to write? What would you say to them? Would you say that, you know, the guidance on how to write, was that useful at all? Oh, yeah, it was definitely very useful for me. Personally, because English is my, well, I speak three different languages. So being guided on how to write was powerful as well, because then I was able to write my story even better. And, yeah. and knowing that like your language, you know, uh, English is your like second language. Uh, would you say that uh, you felt a bit of pressure to perform and to like have good quality writing? Okay. Am I, exactly. am I right in saying that? And exactly. then um, was was uh, you can say the meditation useful and the you know the the guidance on how to write the chapter useful from that respect and would you say that people who don't know how to write will be uh, alleviated knowing that they get enough guidance to actually write it even if they don't know how to write anything? Oh, for sure, they will get so much value out of it. Because like me, for when Marie told us about it, I was in a retreat with her. I was like, yes, I'm going to do this. Then at the same time, I was like, oh my gosh, I want to do this. But what about my writing? <laughs> and what, it was all included. So thank you so much. What about people that uh, have like writer's block or maybe they're thinking, you know, I don't have like anything to write about. What would you say to them? Like if they, I don't, they don't have time, for example, to write, what would you say? I would say that by doing the meditation that Marie guided us to do for our writing, it will come, it will open up. For me, when I said yes to this, I didn't have a story. Well, I had a story, but it hadn't come clear yet. But when I did the meditation, the flow was easier. Mm -hmm. it, 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 it happens. And we don't, we don't always know how that happens, right? But yeah. when we're excited to do it, it does show up. Yeah. You know, like for me, I think the thing I like the most from the entire process, because you can say now we are co-authors, part of the same book, Global Conscious Entrepreneurs. And the thing I liked the most was being part of this, such a loving community and supportive and appreciative and uh, I haven't really seen that, um, you know, to such extent, like so much love. There was so much support in the group. And um, and I really loved connecting with you because you you flew from all the way, I mean, from the U.S., right? Was it from Denver or what was it? Yes. Um, from yeah. Uh, and And you flew all the way from the U.S. to come to London. You were going to London anyway. And it was so nice for us to connect 
And, and the reason why it's so nice to connect, I think, is also not because uh, only like you can say in a way the book united us, you know, it created like a strong bond between us. And at the same time, I feel like um, because I know now what you do. OK, so if I have, you know, someone in your area that needs your services, I would be like so confident knowing to refer them to you because um I trust you now, you know, and I think the book also builds layers of trust among people that you hadn't known before, but they're all like trusted experts in their field. So you're, you're like a trusted, you're a trusted expert. And then there are many other trusted experts and we're all kind of like united together in this quest to make a bigger difference worldwide. And that's what I really, really liked about uh, the program, actually. And that's what um, I loved about you as well. Um, and thank you so much for this uh, review for Marie Diamond Publishing and also for the, the program where I was also supporting the this program to, um, you know, to make it a bestseller and to, um, you know, get um, a bigger visibility for all the authors. Thank you so much. Thank you, Lily.